Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Queen Ray and I'm back with a cooking video today. I am cooking up some um, 80-20 Angus beef, making nachos today for us. So we'll have nachos today and tomorrow. I'm cooking two pounds of round Angus um, beef in a skillet. I got it on the with your cargo, so that's why I'm cooking up in my cast iron skillet. If you guys don't have a cast iron skillet, get you one that cooks the best. Got my handy dandy home network um, meat chopper. This, this uh, right here is a game changer for cooking and dicing up meat. So I got it in cold. Makes it so much easier. And I will show you guys when the meat is done. Stay tuned. So, see, that's what I mean, guys, about this meat chopper. See how easy it dices your meat up. And my meat was still a little bit froze a little bit. But it goes right through it really good. That's just meet up really good. So if y'all don't have one of these, get you one. Like I said, I got mine and Cole's Food Network brand, but they sell them everywhere. So I to add some extra flavor in the nacho meat. I'm going to add in some of this uh, great value seasoning blend, which is onions, celery, red peppers, green peppers, and parsley flakes. Yeah, lemon. So this is my bowl of nachos, guys. I got some fresh green jalapenos on there, some fresh green bell peppers, some green onions, a little bit of sharp cheddar cheese, a little bit of daisy sour cream, some fresh parsley, and got my seasoned beef under there with the tortilla shells. That's what I'm gonna have on mine. I forgot to get some tomatoes. So, and I forgot to get a lettuce too. But I think I got enough green veggies on there, so. I had some fresh spinach I could have cut up, but this is good. So I'm about to enjoy my nachos, homemade nachos. That's what we're having for dinner today. And tomorrow, I am not cooking. So let me know in the comments what you guys cooking today. Thanks for watching. Y'all be blessed. Bye, guys.